Good morning traders and welcome to the daily call today Friday the 14th of June. Before we get started as always please understand that any advice in today's session is of a general nature only and that your personal circumstances have not been taken into consideration. Okay let's have a look at uh, the data that came out yesterday the only uh, news release and, and numbers came from Australia um, our unemployment change number was better than the forecast with more jobs being created at 42.3 thousand uh, whilst the unemployment did creep up a little bit at 5.2 percent a lot of those uh, additional jobs um, were warranted to part-time positions that were created so the numbers in themselves aren't, were not as rosy as what they appeared to be consequently Aussie dollar did uh, continue to slide down as a result of that news and there are now economists basically saying that uh, another rate cut later in the year is almost a certainty as the job numbers and the data figures are just not strong enough at the moment. So there you have it, that's what's happened yesterday, our Aussie dollar did slide down a little more. Time to have a look at our chart of the day the chart that I found for us this morning well, incidentally before I show you this one uh, yesterday's chart of the day did not trigger we broke uh, in a downward direction so the support level did not hold not to worry uh, we move on and we look for another trade um, nothing happened on that one this morning we have the Aussie Swiss on a daily time scale um, and you can see there that yesterday's candle, that red one, uh, as the Aussie went down. But basically what it's done is it's come towards the support line. A lot of you might be asking me about this particular point here where we have a really long wick that went down. That was uh, what we would call something abnormal in the market. Whenever we have a big spike like that, uh, that was created at the start of the year. Um, it was the flash crash uh, incident but uh, if you notice that the activity is is really here uh, apart from that one week so this is really in my in my eyes counted as a support level which basically means we've got one two we've come there for a third time let's see if we can produce a price action reversal pattern so let's wait for it the little tiny candle that you can see there is this morning's candle and it is about an hour and a half old um, let's see if we can produce a reversal pattern and then if so we are all set ready to go Aussie Swiss on a daily time scale is our chart of the day okay what's happening for the final session of the week we have this evening at 10 30 p.m. from the US we have core retail sales and retail sales due to be released and then at 10 55 from the UK we have the Bank of England Governor Carney will be speaking that pretty much wraps up the session guys as always please feel free to contact us if you do have any questions follow me on Twitter at ChatFX for trade setups and breaking news most importantly hope you all have a fantastic trading day have a great weekend and I'll talk to you on Monday for Daily Call bye for now